Hey, how's it going? Patriot, reporting for duty, welcome back to my channel. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you're new and drop a like, because I am going to be doing more FIFA 20 videos, news, updates, as well as daily live streams, so make sure you have subscribed to become part of the Patriot Army. Let's get right into the video. So today's video is FIFA 20 card designs. I spent hours on hours over the last couple of days collecting different card designs. You can see all of them here. If you want to vote on your favorite card, be sure to follow me on Twitter at Patriot FC and subscribe on YouTube so let's move on alrighty we have the new FIFA 20 card designs I've got over 30 designs here uh, we've got team of the week designs we've got team of the year designs we got UCL designs icon designs as well as special card designs which might be coming next year as special cards which we haven't seen before but we are gonna start off with the gold designs so let's get right into it there we go so these are the first three gold designs right here. I'm using Ronaldo's card as a base because he has been the cover star of the last FIFA and he might be the highest rated card in the game once again. Messi might get a similar rating or even a 94 himself, but this is not a ratings video. This is a card video. Let me know which card design you like the most. I think I like the third one the most because it's different, okay? It stands out. I like all of the designs, but the third one is just Something we haven't seen before, and I think it would be interesting if EA get a similar design done. Maybe even an exact design, maybe a copy, maybe a replica. Maybe they'll reach out to the creator of the cards. But I spent a lot of time looking them up and finding different designs for you guys. So I would appreciate if this video could smash a minimum of 25 likes. Um, yeah, let's move on to the next set of cards then. So these are another three gold card designs, which I do like. Out of those three, I think they're all cool. Some of them are a little similar, but I think the first one stands out to me a little bit. I like the outer rim it has. Same with the third design, but I think the first one is more like um, vanilla, more simple, more, um, I don't know, more usual to the last year's designs, which I do like. It's like clean, simple, plain, and uh, it's traditional. That's what I'm trying to say. But then again, the third one is similar, but it has a cooler background, it's a bit brighter, it, sh brighter, it shines at you, and obviously the 94 and striker um, on the card it seems to be a different font, like a maroony font, which would be interesting to see, but I reckon EA will stick to the black font as per usual. Moving on to the next cards, we have the Team of the Week cards, and these ones are one of the most exciting, because what are we going to get this year? I'm not sure. We don't know yet, but the second one is the coolest one in my opinion. It just stands out, okay? Usually Team of the Week cards, you know, are fully black, they're dark, with a bit of a gold shine to them. I do like the first design, I do like the third design. All of them are equally cool, I'd say, but, but the second one just edges it. it. It shouts at you with, like, you know, prestige. You know, you want to have that card on your team. It's really, really cool. I like how much gold there is in it. I love how it shines on your face. Um, it looks great on Ronaldo as well. So I think the second one is my favorite, even though all of them are great. Uh, I'd be happy if we get any one of those three designs. But then again, that's up to EA to implement them in the game. And I'm sure they've already got like a template for the cards, which they should be releasing in around a month's time, which I will be covering. So make sure you are subscribed to the channel. And follow me on Twitter to continue the card debate. There'll be links in the description if you want to follow me. Let's move on to the next set of Team of the Week cards. No, we don't have any more Team of the Week cards. We have Wants to Watch cards which operate on a similar level. Basically, if you don't know what a Wants to Watch card is, have you been living under a rock? No, nah, I'm just kidding. All right. Wants to Watch cards, right? Players that do a big transfer get them like uh, I think if Bruno Fernandes joins Man United, he'll get a Wants to Watch card. Ronaldo had one to Juve last year. I'm pretty sure he did, but then again, that card was unattainable for me, so I, I, I'm, I'm not sure. And I'm pretty sure that EA have released the design, which is the middle design, which looks crazy. I love it. It's probably the most standout out of the three, but I do like the blue designs with the arrows uh, indicating this, you know, transfer deal swap move, which is pretty cool. Let me know which one you like the most. I think the one in the middle just like shouts at you. It's like an 80s theme and all that stuff, which is really cool. And um, I think the middle one is what we're going to get from EA. And I wouldn't be too upset because it's a really cool card design, which I do rate. Even though the third one has a really good color and contrast on it, which has a really cool 
vibe. I think all of those cars have like retro 80s, 90s vibes, but that just could be me. Uh, moving on, what do we have here? The UCL cards. Now, the first two designs are pretty similar. They're pretty cool. In my opinion, they're a bit too dark. We want a card to have a bit more shine on it, all right? But I think we could be getting something very similar in FIFA 20. And the third card is obviously like a UCL moments or a UCL man of the match card, which looks crazy. That's definitely the best design out of the three. I love that one. I think it's great. Um, if we see this card in the game, it'll be incredible. You know, you can see Ronaldo get in one for sure. Maybe Messi. Maybe a Pogba. Nah, Pogba won't get one. That's a troll. Come on, let's be honest. Pogba's not even in Champions League of United. Unless he gets a move to Juve or Real Madrid, then he might be getting a UCL moments card. Um, yeah. That was, that, was, that was embarrassing, bringing up Pogba. Just, just a little spoof, okay? Let's move on to the next batch of cards, which is the Icons and Footmas card. Now, that Footmas card is probably the best design I've seen ever. Like, we had Footmas for two or three years now, and how have EA not come up with a design like that? It's fresh. It looks... It just looks good. The contrast between the red and the green looks sick. I'm liking it. I hope we get that kind of design next year. And then the Icon designs, which are pretty cool. Um... I don't know which one I like more. I guess we could be seeing both of them in the game. One for like a prime moments, one for a normal icon. And I like the middle one because it has like a normal gold card template with like the icon, um, you know, design on it. And then the third one has more of like a advanced design, which is cool. I, I do like the outer border on it. The border line looks absolutely crazy. And... Um, I don't know which one I'd pick out of the three. I think I have to leave one that one up to you. And then moving on to the special cards, which we could see in FIFA now. We have three very different special designs. I'm going to start off with the first one. and I've got no clue what that design could be. We see a lot of colors, some purple, some blue, some orange, and I love it. Like a card like that would be cool. Maybe it would be like some sort of like record breaker or hero card i don't know what you'd get it for but i would love to have it in my club just because it looks so sick um it'd be nice to see ea release it the middle one the blue and the green looks crazy i don't know once again what that card could be probably an spc card maybe a squad battles card could we get squad battle rewards with player picks that would be dope that's something EA should definitely think about. I reckon there's an opportunity there. Let me know if you'd love to see Squad Battle Rewards and drop that like if you would. And then the final card, the Galaxy card. I can't see this one being in the game. It's just too cool. EA would not go for that card because why would you have a Galaxy card? Maybe Messi and Ronaldo should get one because they're out of this world and nobody stands next to them stats-wise and performance-wise and just how good they've been over the last 10 years. So maybe they should get an out-of-the-world Galaxy card, but that's not going to happen. Come on. EA is an arcade game. Well, FIFA 20 and FIFA 19 and all the FIFAs have been arcade games with Ultimate Team Mode. But then again, I can't see EA pushing it that far. We're going to have normal gold cards. We're going to have some special cards. But I can't see the Galaxy card being implemented, even though it would be a great addition, which I would love in FIFA. So... If you haven't already, make sure you do subscribe to the channel, drop a like if you enjoyed. Out of the six gold card designs, let me know which one is the coolest. I'm going to have to go for three. But then again, I do really like four and two. Do you know what? Between two, three, and four for me, to be honest. But three is the winner because it's so different. It's a cool honeycomb design. I love it. And make sure you do subscribe, like I said. We're on our way to 1.5 thousand subscribers. Let's go. Follow me on Twitter to follow the debate. Um, we'll have a vote on Twitter as well. And if you want to support the channel, you can become a member for 4 99 Get custom emojis, custom badges, and get highlights in the stream. You get a lot of cool stuff. Check it out. I'd really appreciate that. Um, yeah. So, that's it for the video. Thanks so much for watching again. I'll see you soon with another one. I'll try to be doing, you know, 4 5 uploads a week so far we've got two and two as well as streams i've done like four streams yesterday so not only are we going to do fifa 19 fifa 20 we're going to do a bit of minecraft a bit of rocket league a bit of um what else have we got there rust whatever guys you recommend i probably will give it a go so make sure you do check out my live streams because they're a lot of fun they're a lot of laughs they're a lot of banter i'll see you guys in the next video Thanks for watching so much. I really appreciate that. Bye-bye.